I have seen four really, really good slash great films in a row that are part of the Oscar conversation. What? Four in a row. What did you see? Then that's been, I don't remember the last time that happened. Pinocchio. Oh, yeah. Great film. All Quiet on the Western Front. I haven't seen that yet. I hear it's great, though. Bardo. Oh, okay. And Babylon. Nice. Boom, boom, boom. Like I watched back to back to back to back Top sixes. Gun Maverick for the first You time. finally did! <laughs> oh, I can't wait to hear what you think. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. I'm Tom Cruise. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks to Patreon, follow us on account, and subscribe to that like button. If I were Tom, we'd be doing this review falling out of a plane. What review? Reaction. So, <laughs> this is a review because we're going to hear what Corbin, the last person on earth to finally <laughs> see Top Gun Maverick. What'd you think? I think it got fun in the end. I was actually bored in the first half. You were? Yeah. I was oh, pretty Well, because you don't like Tom Cruise. I was pretty bored in the first half. I was like, when is like shit going to happen? Like, I don't. And Tom Cruise just doesn't impress me. You as an didn't actor. like when and Miles Teller comes in and he's playing the piano, and we have the flashback to the original Top Gun means nothing to me. Oh. <laughs> That's why. That's why I thought it was fun in the end. I yeah. think it was some obviously a bunch of fun plane action stuff, yeah. but um, yeah, I mean, it's was... you know, one of my favorite. It probably things. way cooler, obviously, in theaters. Obviously, in four D, my friend. Yeah, for sure. Micah and I saw it opening night, 4D. That was the way to experience yeah. that movie. Uh, but uh, an even more fun film of the year, PS2 is coming. Did you hear about we, it? We knew it would. I, I, I've heard there's something to see in it, preparation for it. And we've known, yeah. he said himself... That it was coming next year, yeah, which we were really glad about. That we didn't have to wait five years for the for the it's part coming two. Coming in April. That wow, I didn't expect it that soon. I think it's April twenty. Oh, that's great. But I believe currently is also when Rocky versus or Ali and Renvier's film is coming out. Oh, uh, so nice. Who knows if Kieran keeps it? That, oh, I'm that so date. glad that's coming out in April. It's all still fresh. Yes. Wonderful. Which is why you should, if you have multiple films, always film them at once, and so the audience doesn't have to wait a billion years. Yeah, Avatar. Yeah. Really, <laughs> re well, he's doing it now. Yeah. That's why he filmed these next ones all at the same time. But anyway, so like it, this isn't even a teaser. I think they just announced it, but I think there's uh, some flashes. And okay. It's just kind of, uh, if you haven't seen our review of PS1, go watch it. One of the best films of last year. We and if, really yeah, if you win. haven't seen PS1. Yeah. Uh, you should have saw it in theaters. In theaters. Um, even though it's not like a... Don't go in considering looking for Bahubali. No. Go, go in, in expecting... Story. Story. F think more along the lines of Joda Akbar than you are Bahubali. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so, obviously, Mani Ratnam, A.R. Rahman. Yeah. Uh, and this is P.S. Uh, Pony... Mm -hmm. Pony, Pony and Sullivan. Sullivan. Pony and Sullivan. Um, probably won't get to read the books, but I didn't read the books before in the first one, so I'm yeah. just going to let the movies tell me the story. Exactly. And uh, I'm a even slow though I would reader. Love to know the a Stupid Baby sent me the books. They're beautiful. I started reading it. I would never in a million years. It, it'll take me six, or six years to read those books. Oh, wow. Geez. That's not a joke. All right. Here we go. What a score by our dost there. <laughs> that was like dun 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 Epic. Yeah. A fitting uh I don't even know You had me at P. Yeah. Honestly, you don't even really even need to release a trailer. I know they will for this film. I'd love it if they didn't. Uh, I'd love it if they only released that right there. Yeah. And everything else is come see the movie if you want to see anything else. Because, I mean, it's obviously I know there was a ton of it made a bunch of money, right? Yeah. Uh, which is great. But I know there was a bunch of people that also thought this film was so boring. I don't know. Um, 
I get, like I said, if they were going in expecting Baho Bali, yeah, you'd probably be bored. Um, but I mean, you, we knew from the trailer before we saw the film, right? That's not what this film was going to be. It was it's not, a Monty Rotnam film. You're not going to get I SS Raja Muli exactly. with Monty Rotnam. <laughs> that's the two things. First of all, no false advertising in the trailer. It set it up for what it was. Uh -huh. And if you have, like we do, a basic introduction understanding of some of Monty Rotnam's films, what are you expecting? Yeah. Uh, I do. It, it is his kind of film. I do have a request. Don't cut the songs. What do you mean? In the first one, they were cut down. Oh, yeah. Versions of the songs in the film. I agree. Don't cut down the songs no. again. Yeah. I don't know why you did that in the first one. <laughs> like, they were longer in... in, in they, in on on YouTube, uh, right? And then they, they were just half of that in the film, and I'm like, no. I want the whole. So we like the songs, the and I bet uh, Al Roman does too, <laughs> right? Uh, I would love to be able. I'm to sure talk. it didn't bother him. He got a very nice paycheck, oh, and yeah, he's a happy yeah. camper. He's worked with Money Rotten a lot. Mm, yeah, uh, I, I would love to be able to talk to Money. Uh, Absolutely. Uh, it's it's extremely difficult to get a to get people, especially when you start talking to their managers. Um, <laughs> they call them gatekeepers for a reason. Yes. If I could talk to just the artists themselves, I could get almost anybody. Right. <laughs> Of course. Unfortunately, and fortunately, obviously, they, that's what the managers are there for, to, yes. to be the gatekeepers. Yep. Um, even though... And then even when you do get through, as we've said before, we've had interviews that were a few years in the making. Yes. Where we did speak directly and are currently speaking, and it's just a matter of scheduling. Yes. So... <laughs> I've been talking to so many people. <laughs> Which is the nature of the biz. How many people have wanted to work with other people? Yep. And they take years to finally get to do it. I can't wait to see more of the uh, female characters, especially, obviously, uh, Ashwarya. Yeah. The, I want to But all, everybody. I mean, everybody was great. Because they were all wonderful. Uh, but especially Ashwarya. She's the one. She's the power player, man. She's the one that uh, pulls the strings. Yes. Uh, and she looked, obviously, phenomenal. Yep. Uh, in this film. Um, and so I'd imagine we'll get song releases again. Uh, and we're going to get a trailer at some point. But the fact that we... It came out in what? It was the summer. September? Late, it was late summer. No, I was... Or was it just as we were entering fall? Just as entering fall, because I was in Texas. But it was before Brahmastra. It was after Brahmastra. It was? Yeah. You sure? Vikram Veda and this dropped on the same day. Okay. And that was, I believe, end of September, beginning of October. All right. I think. Yeah. End of September, beginning of October. And so the fact that we only have to wait l half a year. You, you know what it's like? It's awesome. It's it's like a TV show you love ha ending their season and starting their next season. Yeah. Yeah. House of Dragon coming back in like 2025 or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> Always film your shit at the same time. God, it's so annoying. <laughs> I mean, I guess Game of Thrones is different because they have so much CGI that they have to. It's so big. Uh, it's so expansive. They spend, they spend so much money on yeah. all their shit, man. Uh, as opposed to like The Bear, which probably you could film in a couple months and it'd be out at the end of the year yes there's not really any cgi which is a great show by the way yeah. if you haven't seen the bear love the bear the bear was great great show so uh, is white lotus we've yeah, talked about yeah, that before that another one, great yeah. show um, but very excited obviously yeah. for this uh looking forward to it looking forward to the new song releases from our dosti of dosti Rahman and the the new film which if i'll watch i'll watch ps1 again oh before because there's so much to be refreshed about so much information. I'll have to, uh, maybe we'll do a watch along, uh, which might be fun right before the this one drops or something like that. that yeah, be that'd be fun. Uh, we've already seen it, obviously. No, but you know what would be good to do? We could do a watch along with Ashley, Alexis, or Micah who, who yeah. hadn't seen it yet. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Uh, anyways, so you guys let us know uh, if you are excited for this. Uh, and if you're not, you're dumb. Uh, <laughs> let us know what you think down below. Josh!